we know that the area of a circle is pi r square. But where does this pi r square come from? Let's understand. Take a circle and divide it into 12 equal parts. I just rearranged these parts. Let me cut this side part into two halves. Bring one of them to the other side and the shape starts resembling a rectangle though these two sides are still curved. However, if we had divided the circle into infinitely many small parts and rearranged them like we did, the curved side flattens and it becomes a perfect rectangle. Let's now find the area of this rectangle because it would be the same as the area of our original circle. We know that these two opposite sides of the rectangle together measure the same as the circumference of the circle. So the length of the rectangle becomes half of 2 pi r that is pi r. This other side is the same as the radius of the circle or r. So the area of the rectangle becomes pi r multiplied by r that is pi r square. I found this tool in the National Science Center, Delhi, which is used to illustrate the same concept. If you enjoyed this video, do like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. So, next time someone asks where the pi r square comes from, you know the answer.